care of features, but you fall from the center floor. I done seen your personality in candy hoes. Trying to play me, you already know. It won't end the way you ready for. You a soft girl, but you want hard. Hey, y'all. So it is Friday, 651 p.m. and I'm on my way to my co-workers concert he's in this rock and roll band and they're opening up for like it's like really popular band I don't know nothing about rock and roll I'm just going to support <laughs> and this is my outfit I got on this purse from Aldo this used to be my mom it's a funny story I bought this purse for my mom <laughs> for her birthday then when she passed away my grandma wore it and now I'm just wearing it so yeah, Granny gave me this jacket for Christmas. Regular, like long sleeve, white turtleneck with some, I don't even know if y'all can tell. Let me see. I don't know if y'all can tell, like the jeans are like flared a little bit. I got on like these booties. Yeah, so this is the outfit. Really simple, you know? But I just wanted to check in. There goes some good lighting. I just wanted to check in. Let y'all know what I was doing. I don't know if I'm pulling my camera out <laughs> while I'm at the concert, but I might record off my phone. But yeah, on my way to a rock and roll band concert type thing. Hopefully it's fun. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's me, it's the next day. It is Saturday and I am about to record a Shein try on haul. But I did wanna let y'all know how the show was. <laughs> it was nice. My coworker did a great job. But that second group that performed, Hair Bangers Ball. <laughs> so both of the groups are tribute bands, which means they sing songs from other artists and that's like, that's their whole gig. This second band, people like literally came from different parts of the city to come see them. Like they're a big thing. And their whole thing is 80s rock and roll. I don't know nothing about no 80s rock and roll. So I was just sitting there like, you know, but either way, it was nice to get out the house. It was nice to support my coworker. He did a great job on his set and yeah but the way i woke up with an earache because that music was so loud i had a headache i'm still getting over some type of cold or whatever the weather out here is ridiculous you guys when i say like one day is 50 the next is 70 then it's 40 then it's 75 again then it's back to 30 degrees <sighs> get it together mother nature i'm not questioning god i'm just saying what's going on but um, let me get to recording this content because I think it's already pretty much five o'clock. It's 4.51. I was supposed to record this. Like I got up to do this at 12 o'clock, but I had to take a nap because my head was hurting so bad. So I took an Alka, uh, I took an Alka Seltzer Plus, um, drank a whole bunch of water, ate, and I was knocked out. But now I'm up, now I'm good, so we gotta get to work. I am done recording um, the try on haul. So I think that one's definitely going to be up before this vlog. So if you haven't watched it, go back and watch that haul for me. <sighs> right now I'm waiting for my cousin to come over. She ordered some things off my website and because she's my cousin, I'm allowing her to pick up at my house. <laughs> so I'm waiting on her and then I'm gonna start editing because at this very moment, there's no vlogs up. So yeah, I'm waiting for her to come. She's gonna pick up her order and then I'm gonna start editing. I have a lot to edit. <laughs> I have reels, shorts, vlogs, the Shein haul, all types of things to edit. And it's gonna be a chill night. I have no plans. I got on my linty robe <laughs> and I'm just gonna chill. So if I do anything, of course, I'll let you guys know, but I highly doubt if I do anything other than edit. Hey y'all, it is Sunday morning. I'm on my way out the door. I'm about to go to Walmart. 
I want to go to like Burlington. I kind of want to go to Home Goods and I want to go to like Marshalls or TJ Maxx, but I don't think I am. I want to go to Home Goods because I want a big mirror, but it's not important. And I'm thinking about going to TJ Maxx or Marshalls because I've been watching TikToks and the girls be finding good stuff up in there. But again, I don't need to go, but I do need to go to Walmart because we need some stuff for the house. So yeah, and I just might. Stop at Chipotle. <laughs> it's supposed to be 70 degrees today. It's currently 54. So I feel like I don't need this big jacket that I always wear. I feel like I should bring it anyways. I don't know. We'll see once I get outside and I'll take it off if I need to when I get in the store. But this purse is just the cutest to me. I love this little purse. Let's get out of here and do what we got to do so we can come back home. Okay, y'all. First stop is Walgreens because I think they still have their detergent for $10. And I've been racking up. One thing about it, I'm gonna have some clean clothes. Cause every time they have this sale, I always get four for $10. So let's go in here and see if they still had it. I think they should, but I don't know if the sale ends today or if it ended yesterday. So let's just go in here and check it out. y'all we just left walgreens we got our detergent oh it's windy hold on it's so windy i don't even know if y'all heard me but detergent wasn't four for ten because it was the tide i believe that would have been four for ten they had the arm and hammer which i also used it was buy one get two free so i still got it so i only spent eight dollars on that i told granny like one week i'll like stock up on like a lot of body wash then like the next week i'll stock up on like a lot of detergent i really need to like start finding coupons for paper towels and toilet tissue for real for real but honey we're about to go to the car wash because my girl is dirty Oh, y'all can't even see me because of the sun. So, remember I told y'all the weather, it was supposed to get up to 68, which is dang near 70. But that do not mean tank top and shorts. I put up to Walmart. The girls got on tank top and shorts. Baby, it's only 61 degrees right now. It's only 1030. And here I am with a wool jacket on. Ciao. I got on a wool jacket with a hoodie underneath. Hey, y'all. It is a Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon and I just got off work. Well, I just got home from work. Turn this TV off. So me and Granny, we, dang, I turned it off before I come back home. Dang, the TV ain't used to going off this early. Right. <laughs> All right, so me and Granny are on our way out. We're going to get more plants. So I didn't show y'all um, what I got from Walmart, but isn't she a beauty? We got her. What was it, Sunday? And then, Granny got a little bitty baby. That little thing. <laughs> <laughs> she thought it was way bigger than what it actually is. Sorry, I know I know the lightning is going crazy. So, Granny thought <laughs> that little bamboo was way bigger. So, we're actually on our way to the store so we can actually get a real life-size bamboo because that's a little bitty baby. But yeah, <laughs> Granny's about to get a mom for the baby. <laughs> Cause that little thing, <laughs> what do you have to say for yourself, Granny? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what happens when you get old. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> We're taking your car, okay? Okay. All right, so we out. We'll see you when we get to the store. y'all so we're back home we went for a bamboo <laughs> and they didn't have the big bamboos like i thought they would because i know in the summertime they have like the really big nice cute bamboos but i guess since it's winter they're out of them or they didn't have any in stock and then i saw that cute little small money tree so that's cute i think we're going to repot them or granny's going to repot them both of them so we're going to take them out of the red vases put them in different vases potter planters whatever but yeah we just added two new plants to our family <laughs> 
Hey y'all, good morning. It is, oh, I don't even know what looks better. I just look crazy. But anyway, y'all, it is a Saturday morning and I'm about to do my hair, clearly, but I'm downstairs in the basement because I'm gonna try to record a YouTube video. So hopefully if this goes right, you will see a hair review, hair tutorial type thing before this vlog. I hope to come out cute because I need something done to my hair and I'm tired of ponytails. But I just want to check in and let y'all know that I was up doing something. So I'm really trying to get back active and like diversify my content on YouTube. First of all, let me let me stop. Let me come back to y'all later because I don't even want to talk to y'all looking like this because I look so crazy. So let me kind of fix my hair up, put on some makeup, and I'll be right back. What's up, y'all? So I know I said y'all was gonna see me again when I had my makeup on and I look pulled together, but I could have swore we had hair dye in the house and I can't find it. So I'm headed to CVS because it's right around the corner and I need to just buy some jet black hair dye because it's a V part wig that I'm putting in my head and it has like these brown streaks in it and I don't like that. Like I really could put it in and get away with it like it ain't no big deal but I want to dye the hair jet black or at least black so it can match my hair. So yeah. It's only 8.44, so it's really early in the day. I do have to be at Janae's suite at 1.30, so I got time. I just, I knew I should've did this yesterday and I didn't, so I'm annoyed with myself. There ain't nobody in this parking lot, so I had to park right in front of the hours <laughs> to make sure that they were open. But yeah, as y'all can see, they open at eight o'clock and it's 8.47. Okay, y'all, so I just picked up a concealer. I haven't used LA Girl Pro Concealer in a long time, but I just picked up medium beige, and I told myself I wanted to go to TJ Maxx or Marshall so I could find a curling iron, and they have some at CVS. It's Conair, I don't know. I kind of was gonna look for hot tools, but I don't know, maybe I should just wait because I don't wanna make myself mad. I'm gonna see what they got with Elf. Where is Elf? Where is Elf? I didn't come here for makeup, but I need some more of this. Oh, girl, they got the lip oils at CVS. The one I already had, the pink quartz. They're $6 here. I thought they were $8 at Target. They got, oh no, they are $8. They're $8. This one is the crystal clear. All right, let me look for what I actually came here for. All right, I don't know if I should get the dark and lovely jet black or this Revlon soft black. Of course, the Revlon is cheaper. I feel like I'm just gonna get the jet black. Mm, I should be okay. Y'all, I ended up going for one thing and spent $42 in there. I've been saying I wanted some popsicles for the longest and they had those outshine. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. I love these little fruit bars. They had these, buy one, get one 50% off. So I bought those. I actually went to the area because I wanted to get a Sprite. But I was like, you know what? It's a little bit healthier. So yeah, I got that. Buy one, get one 50% off. I got the, it's cold, hold on. I got the LA Girl Concealer. I got the Dark and Lovely Jet Black Hair Dye. I got some conditioner because I use like the very last of it. I love this brand. This is what I use as conditioner on my weave and my natural hair. And um, I got the Elf Primer. So yeah, I spent $42 up in CVS. But I do have a coupon for $4 off my next purchase. So I'll probably come back and use that. And I also got a dollar off deodorant and I need some deodorant. But they didn't have the deodorant that I used and I wasn't trying to try something new and I'd be out here funky, okay? So let's get back home, it's 9.05. Let's do this hair and let's be on time for this appointment because y'all know how time be getting the best of us. We be on time and then suddenly we be late. All right, y'all. It look like I'm missing something because I am because I don't have my lashes on, but I'm going to Janae's suite to get my lashes done. But this is the money tree that we, go ahead. I was gonna do it while you was talking. Oh, okay, that's the money tree that we got from the store. So what me and Granny did was we put like a little wish in there, a goal, I guess you could say. And as we plant it and as the tree grows, so will our wish come true, I guess if that makes sense. But yeah, 
that's our little money tree thing so i guess if you want to get a money tree you could take a piece of paper and write like some goals or i don't know wishes desires prayers whatever and put it in the soil and water it because it's paper because like paper dissolves yeah it dissolves so it should like just go with the plant i don't know whatever <laughs> oh and this is the bamboo that we got next to jesus but yeah and over the lions if y'all ever notice these lions are from granny's granny um oh yeah my mom, my mom. your mom oh, okay yeah these lambs oh, and lions 83. she's half since 83 these are from her mom I think you just bought this, right? Nobody gave it you, Jesus. I bought Jesus. So before 77, she bought Jesus. <laughs> and then we just bought this Wednesday. <laughs> the plan. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I'll see y'all when I get in the car or when I get to Janae's job. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I always forget to, like, charge my phone at night. When I woke up, my phone was dead. And even right now, at 1.10 p.m., it's only on 55%. Crazy. I can't wait to get these lashes done because I feel like with my face on, I need some lashes. Like something's missing, you know? <sighs> but yeah, it's gonna take me about 20 minutes to get to her place. And I think I'm gonna be three minutes late, which isn't bad, but yeah. I'm about to play some music and I'll catch you guys in a few. I made it. The beauty queen is in the back. <laughs> We're at Lashway Boulevard, period. Yes, period. So I'll come back when my lashes are done. <laughs> Y'all. We, like, we have baddies on your page. I love having baddies on my page. Oh my God, not me and baddies. You and baddies. Lashway Boulevard. Boulevard did that. Okay. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> All right, y'all. So my lashes. My lashes are done. They look so good. This is my first time ever getting bottom lashes. But yes, if you are in the Chicagoland area, definitely check out Janae at Lashway Boulevard. I'll make sure that her information is on the screen. And it will be in the description box because my girl is fire. Love, 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 love this. Why my t-shirt all scrunched up? Anyways, I thought I was going to skip out on this, but my grandma, my uncle, and my cousins are at Texas Roadhouse. So I'm about to meet them up there. They've already even started ordering. They still said I should come. So I'm about to go to Texas Roadhouse to meet Granny and her family. I'm supposed to be turning. I'm missing directions. Ooh, y'all. Let me talk to y'all when I get there because I almost missed my turn. <laughs> Trying to vlog and drive. And I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I just got done filming the intro and outro to the hair review that I did for this video. Hopefully the footage is good, because if not, I'm not even gonna post it. I'm not even gonna hold you. But this side, it's like, the curls are weird. I like this side a lot better. Either way, I hope you guys watched that video. Is it too bright? My bad, I don't know what's going on with my camera settings, but I hope you guys watched that video and You'll get all the deets on this hair, but I will leave it in this description box. If you're interested, I think I'm about to take this off so I can lay down because that's why I wanted this is a V part. So I can literally clip this on, clip this off. I don't have to sleep in it. <sighs> yeah, but I think I'm about to finish Love is Blind, okay, because I started it last night. And I watched up to season, not season three, but episode three. I'm on the last season because I heard all the ones in between were horrible. I've only watched the first one all the way through with Cameron and Lauren. I love them. They're so beautiful together. But I don't think no episodes are going to be, I mean, no seasons are going to be like them for real. But um, if you watch Love is Blind, leave a comment below and let me know what you think about it. By the time I post this, I should be done and I'm just waiting on the reunion. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I watched three episodes last night, which is three hours, and then I got sleepy. So I think I'm gonna finish it tonight or at least finish it by tomorrow. But definitely let me know what you guys think about Love is Blind. I've been trying not to watch any of like the spoilers or whatever, but I'm so glad Matthew left because 
um matthew and ad would have been so awkward he was like so rude in the house and yeah they would have made a very 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 odd couple considering like how he acts around people and then how he was trying to like front with her or whatever um i don't like clay and i don't even think they're gonna like make it like that but i don't like clay for her either i don't remember the names but the principal with the teacher for some reason i don't think they're gonna it's like something about it just seems like it's gonna be very short term and then also like the puerto rican girl with the white guy with the long reddish blonde hair they're cute but i also for some reason don't really see them um making it long for some reason and then also oh my god what's the girl was it jessica is it jessica the one that has the baby or the 10 year old daughter so the megan fox girl jeremy and her this little love triangle i am so curious to see who he is going to pick and why and how jessica is going to feel if she does or doesn't get chosen or if they're gonna, i don't know if they're gonna last because yeah it's just very 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 interesting but let me know your thoughts don't spoil it for me yet i hope because I don't know. I should be done by the time this video is posted, but yeah, I'm about to take this wig off and I'm about to start editing some videos and I'm going to watch Love is Blind. So I'll see you guys later. Hey y'all. So it is Saturday and it's around 11 o'clock. Y'all know time went up. We sprung forward. So yeah, I lost that hour of sleep and I don't like that. But anyways, I'm at TJ Maxx because I want to find a curling iron. Hold on. My bad, I'm over here texting and all that stuff. But I'm at TJ Maxx because I want to get a curling iron. And the only one I have at home is a 3 4th barrel. And I want to get one that an inch and a half, I believe. Everybody loves that T3 curling iron. But yeah, I'm not spending a hundred and something dollars on a curling iron right now. And I think their barrels are an inch and a half. Or I guess you could choose. I don't know. I think I think I'm either gonna get an inch and a quarter or an inch and a half. Anyway, y'all know when I wear like weave, I wear long weave. So I want something with a bigger barrel. Anyways, I just wanted to let y'all know what was going on. Let y'all know it was a new day. And I did not get to watch, excuse me, I didn't get to watch um Love is blind last night because Netflix was tripping talking about my TV wasn't part of my family plan or something. I'm like, I own the family plan. What are you talking about? I didn't want to fight with it. It was late. So I didn't finish it. So hopefully it works tonight, which is weird because I watched it the night before. So why last night was it acting crazy? I don't know. They take our money and want to act funny. So ooh, look at me rhyming. Either way, let's go into J no foreign, no need to talk. When I get home, I need to talk. No need for time when I lead her. She got an ass and I grease her mouth. She wanna track when I lead her. Gucci the belt and I'm leaving. Yeah, I got scanners, diamond hair, flannel. All right, y'all. So we just left at the and we didn't get anything. I really could have gotten that <sighs> curling iron that I saw because I saw like two different ones, but I just was just kind of like, mm, I could wait, you know. So, we're gonna go to Walmart. I kinda wanna go across the street and go to Marshall's, but I don't know yet. Let's see. Hey y'all, I don't know if y'all can see, but I'm in Strack and Vance Hill because I need groceries, like vegetables. So the Walmart that I'm by doesn't have like the fresh market type thing, you know what I'm talking about? So, I'm gonna go to Strack's and get everything I need out of there. Oh, that truck almost hit that car. Wow. Oh, that's a company truck, too. Oh, he would have been in trouble. I just seriously just want to go home. I hate grocery shopping, to be freaking honest. But whatever. Let's go in here and get what we got to get and see if we're going to go to another store. Y'all, I just noticed that I have such a routine that is sickening. And I think it's just because it's like the winter time falling into the spring. It's officially spring, right? Or no? I don't know, but it's like springtime. So it's not really 
much to do just yet. So right now my life pretty much is just work, rest, work, run errands, work, work. <laughs> It's not like really much to do. Like me and my friends, we ain't really thawed out yet. <laughs> so I am ready to start getting outside more. Can't wait to book some more trips for sure. But this summer shall be fun. I have a lot of goals that I want to accomplish this year. So praying that I do. And I love that me and Granny are like on the same page with me and us accomplishing certain goals. But yeah, I say all of that to say, <laughs> last Sunday, I believe, went to Walmart, ran my errands, went home. This Sunday, went to the grocery store, ran my errands, I'm going home. It's like, kind of like same old, same old. And I hate to be boring, but like this is my life right now, I guess you could say. But I am going to stop at Chick-fil-A for lunch. It's 12.30. I don't know if Granny has plans to cook something or if I need to cook something. But if she ain't cooking, I need to figure it out. I think she said she was going to church. They have two services today. I think she said she was going to church again. I don't know. We'll see though. I'm going to get some Chipotle. Then I'm going to run my car through the car wash and I'll see you guys when I get back home. Okay, y'all, do I need to grow up? Because every time I get a car wash, I pull out a little tree, black ice. Yes, sir. What's up, y'all? It is later on in the day, it's still Sunday. It is, is it 6.43 or 7.54? It's 7.54. I gotta change the clocks on the stove and the microwave. Dang, it's about time for me to call it a night. I'm still thinking it's right. Daylight savings is already starting to mess me up. Anyways, I am making my infamous strawberry lemonade slushy. So I figured I would show you guys. If you've been here though, like then you already know what's up. I've made this a few times on my channel and this is kind of what made me go viral on TikTok. But I got some strawberries, frozen strawberries. You want to put a decent amount in here. I fill it up about halfway. Then we're going to take Simply Lemonade. Make sure I shake that up real good. And then I'm going to pour. Child, I don't be measuring. Just pour it until it looks right you don't want to put too much and then you don't put too little because the juice is what makes the consistency but lastly we're going to take a packet of strawberry kool-aid put it in there and add sugar to your liking add as much as you want or don't add none at all don't come for me and say oh that's too much oh it's not enough i don't care you make it how you want to make it because on tiktok people talk about how much sugar i use and i'm just like my goodness yeah, then we're going to blend it up. Okay, so then I'm seeing that I need to add a little bit more juice because it's so thick, it's not like blending how I want. And there we have it, strawberry lemonade slushies. And what I use is pretty much good for about two people, maybe even three. I put them in like these big red solo cups. But like, I don't know if you can see how thick it is. So if you want it a little bit more juicier, put more juice in there. But sometimes I like to eat mine with a spoon. I'm gonna make a mess. Oh shoot, I'm making a mess. This is what it looks like. I'm about to eat mine with a spoon. I just made some shrimp pasta. 
and i'm about to chill out for the rest of the night so i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog right here i'm gonna say thank you guys so much for watching this video and chilling with me for another weekly vlog if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed because if you made it to this part of the video and you are not subscribed, it's a problem because you obviously like it here. Leave a comment below because you guys know I love to talk to you. I love when y'all leave comments so we can have a little conversation in the comment section. But I'm going to go ahead and end the video and stop chatting. I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay beautiful and be blessed.